Everybody knows how cool and smoky it is to take a piece of dry ice and drop it into a glass of water, but that's it. Dry ice is actually frozen carbon dioxide and should always be handled carefully under adult supervision with gloves, goggles, or safety glasses. It's called dry ice because it sublimates, which means it turns from a solid to a gas. But enough of the technical mumbo jumbo, let's get to the big boom. Dry ice is normally kept in a styrofoam container because as it sublimates, the gases are allowed to release. But if kept in a plastic container, the gases are not allowed to release. And now that's a big thing. Now I wouldn't try this yourself because that's what I'm here for. Blowing stuff up so you don't have to. Remember, dry ice has a lot of positive uses, but watch out, if not careful, your cooler might end up in the next county. Remember, dry Remember, dry ice. Yes. Okay. Remember, dry ice has a lot of positive uses. But be careful. No, but watch out. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You thought it was funny. Yeah. Okay. <laughs>